What's up you guys? Welcome back. Seven Days to Die. So as you can see, I'm back to day one. All right. So I, I did play into um, three days. But after that video released, the first video released today, as I'm recording this, um, I noticed that the update actually didn't take. Now you can see up there in the, in the top right version 5.2.2 build 108. So this is the new one. Plus, it's got the big backpack mod in it. Now, when I came in, I placed the starter crate. I got stone axe, stone hammer, stone shovel, a flashlight, um, and that's it. Then I put it back down and broke it, and it actually unlocked, if you look, it actually unlocked builder class, but it looked like it, uh, it looked like it unlocked everything. Okay, so these are the stuff, the things that you before had to go around and find, right? So I've got builder's class, survival, survivalist, scholar, marksman, fighter, tradesman, protection, electrician, and covert. So currently I have all these different things. Here's, uh, you know, gather all this different stuff, gather this stuff. So the coolest thing is I'm actually going to be doing this stuff along the way. And that's why once I saw this, I'm like, oh, yeah, definitely, definitely starting over with the upgrade, uh, upgrade, update, upgrade. I've been, uh, yeah, PC lingo. So we're back. And all I'm going to say is I don't recall dying on day one in the other one. So that didn't happen. <laughs> that did not happen. But uh, I want to thank you guys. A couple of you guys reached out to me and um, just said, hey, I don't think you're actually on the right build because you guys saw up there. And I, I, you know, honestly, I didn't even look up there. I figured because I what I what I do is I don't run this across the normal um, on the Steam version. I make a full copy of the whole file. I put it in its own area. So you go to local files, <clears throat> browse local files, make a copy, then paste it Longbow, nice. Paste it right back in there. Long arrow ammo, okay. And and then I drag the mod into there. And then that way, even, I mean, you can always re-verify your files to get rid of that kind of stuff, but uh, it's just easier. So it's isolated. Uh, I like to do that a lot on, on modded games just to keep it isolated. All right, let's make some cloth here. <clears throat> And so I drug it in there and figured I did it I did it right. You know, I had downloaded it before I started. I downloaded the new update. Look at that. Military base. Oh my god. That looks like a pirate ship. Um okay. There's a There's a pirate ship over there. And I wanna go to that. What the it might not be a pirate, but every ship is a pirate ship to me. Anyway, I thought you guys would enjoy a little bit of the background of that. I did actually play three days into it. I do have two videos uploaded, but I'm going to just go ahead and delete them and uh, put this one in its place for Monday. It's late at night on Sunday right now. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so apparently the stumps are being more generous this time. I got to... I got to be... Be careful, because all the zombies are in run mode. There's one, two, three right there. But I want to get to that ship. But I saw these. What the deuce with the... Okay, so apparently bows and arrows are in stumps for days. Okay. All right. Uh, that guy, that guy, that guy. Guy over there. All right, I gotta be careful. And if I get attacked, I gotta throw down this, uh... Oh, shoot! He's chasing me. What the... Uh, I have no idea what that guy's wearing. And I missed. Okay, there's that. In case I die, this guy can't run up a slope. What the? Yeah, right in your shoulder, son. 
He's missing his legs. He's missing his legs. Dude, I think with the update, they were able to change some of the characters. Maybe that's... Oh, dude, is that going to be a boss guy? They actually changed the bow. You can see the bow now is steel. I think they figured out a way to actually get their changes into the game. What the? Right here, right here, right here. All right, you shoot at that guy. Get his attention. Maybe he'll stop chasing me. All right, ran right by that NPC. Okay, we're good. We're fine. I don't know what you guys are so worried about. <laughs> Woo! So, that's cool. I think that... Remember... I don't know if you guys watched when we played through this on You Always Win. The, the icons in the menu actually were changed. But the icons in game, like if you had a like a FAMAS or M416 or, or an M416, wrong game, any of those things, they still look like the default uh, icons in the game. But if you look at that bow, that's different. Now, I could be totally wrong. I don't think that bow is standard in the game, is it? I don't think so. Anyway, we're going to find out, though. I'm going to try and... Oh, shoot. Dude, seriously? They're like everywhere. I should have stayed up on the hill. Oh, jeez, dude. This is not good. They are zigging and zagging. Oh, that was right in the heart. You should be dead. You have no heart, zombie. Mm. I keep running back the other way. I should just try and run toward the direction that I actually needed to go. Okay, you just stay stuck there for a bit. Nope, that was... Oh, what happened, little fella? Did you just get blown up? Jeez, hmm? dude, I can't see the binds in the snow. I'm running, I'm running. I'm running. I was running. Oh my gosh, she's relentless! There's zombies everywhere. At least... Oh shoot, one of those thingies, okay. Okay. I wanna see the ship before I die! I mean... <laughs> oh, I think I may have lost her. Oh my, is it even in water? It's not... It's not in water. <laughs> Melee character. Yeah, you go get them some. Dude, the ship is even in water. What the what the news? Oh my goodness. A lot more, it seems like a lot more NPCs and a lot more zombies. This is gonna be way more fun with this update. Seems like they've done a lot with this update. Now, here's the thing. The, what we were playing, may, maybe it was active for like a long time, and now this update, maybe they've been working on this update for, I don't know, a year or something. That's why there's so, so many changes. Dude. All right. Um, I was going to say, I got to find some place safe around here because I definitely want to stay around this for nighttime. I gather some stuff up, make another bed over here. All right, I'm trying to listen at the same time. I wonder if that hammer actually does any work. It gave me, you see this in the number two spot there? It's called, it's a hammer. Now I wonder if that's their version of a sledge. But remember how the sledge really drains your, your stamina? Now you can see I'm up there collecting wood right now, gather wood. I'll have no issues getting that collected. And then small stones. Yeah, I'll, I'll be able to get through this stuff good, but periodically we'll check in. All I have to do is go in the quest area and click on, you don't have to activate it. Just click on it and make sure that it's doing stuff. Like it says, you know, one of them is like collect plastic. Basically, basically it wants you to loot, right? Loot, loot all this different stuff. And you're going to be working your way toward uh, the second level of each of these. And once you get the second level, you um, they start to give you stuff. And then once you finish the quest, it will actually 
Dude, how cool is that? I want to live on that for a little while. Alright, let's build a bedroll. 19 seconds. Okay. I'm looking for another structure maybe that I could take over. Dude, how, <laughs> I thought... It, I mean, it's awesome. Probably be a little cooler if it was actually in water, but I don't know how they would do that, like in random gen. I don't know. Maybe that. Maybe there's there's a house right over there. Maybe there's some sort of coding they could do. There's a house there, and there's one down there. That one looks farther. There's a house up there. All right. It's very dangerous what I'm doing. I just build my own house. Possibly. Maybe. What the? Okay, that's an NPC. Nice. Why is there... Oh, jeez, dude. I see a flaming barrel there. Housekeeping! Housekeeping. Try this thing. No, look, in my hand they haven't changed. Okay, so I was wrong. In my hand, that's what it was. In your hand, it still looks the same. Okay, it worked pretty good on that guy. Not gonna lie. Oh, I need actually need some shoes. I don't have anything on. Okay, that's what it was, you guys. I, I was confusing myself. It was... Down on the icons, it, you could always see that. It was what it looked like in your hand. That's the big difference. What do you guys think? Up here? Hmm? Oh, wait. I'm still on the wrong thing. I think it'd be a good place up here. Ah, shoot! <laughs> what the news, dude? I didn't need a part of a couch. I needed some goods and services. There we go. We're good. All right, now. Get that done. Can I not repair that? They're gonna hear that, aren't they? All right, I need to make some wood frames. Oh, wood frames. We'll get uh, the old 22 of those. Get them going down here. Chop this out, fill this in. So, I'm actually really, I, I, even more so looking forward to this because like I said, I had just played this mod, but from what I can tell, there's a lot of things changed. Obviously, new POIs. And look at this, look at the backpack size. This one's called the, um, It's there's multiple versions you can get. And it, this one's the one bigger backpack mod or whatever. Oh, so this I can't upgrade with. That's what it is. I can upgrade with this thing, though, interestingly enough. What is that first thing? A stone axe. I can do the hammer, but not the stone axe on the upgrade. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Come on, baby. Ah, this is earlier than last time. I'm actually making a making a little place for myself here. Come on. Nice. These don't need to be like more than just to block light, vision, smell a vision. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So there's a lot of new stuff. So I'm looking forward to that. So I really want to do... Oh, what the heck? <laughs> I didn't want to do that. When you first upgrade, it goes straight to that. Kind of goofy. Okay. Alright, so there's a door there and a back door. So what I need to do is... I'm going to reinforce this. They're going to try and make their way up these stairs, right? So we'll make the door here. Make 
the door right here. Like so. This will be the doorway. You don't want to put the doorway right here because you'll bonk your head. You'll bonk your head. All right, so we need, um, let's get, how much wood do I have? Get 22 more of these, and then we're going to go with a door. Some door action. Craft. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm really, really looking forward to this. I really, remember what I said at in the, I don't know if it was the first, well, I, if I didn't say it in the first episode, you guys wouldn't have heard it. But one of the things I really like about all of these open sandbox type games is when they add in stuff for you to do. Whether it be quests or, you know, looting, looting quests, whatever kind of quest it might be. Um, I really like when they do that. This is kind of just like, buy me a, a little bit of time. I know they're coming in. I know trouble is on the horizon. I'm not sure why I had to do this back here, but maybe they'll get, maybe it'll make him get stuck. I remember last time I I was fight, trying to fight my way over to the um, to the uh, trader, so I didn't have time to like build anything on my house. All right, let's reinforce at least these front ones. What time of day? It's sixteen twenty. We're not doing too bad. This is important. Get this thing established. Because I do really want to uh, check out the old pirate ship. And I may get killed. I want to take some time to look through, get an idea of like what I'm supposed to collect. Okay. I think that that... I think that that is... Uh, there's a plate down there, so I wouldn't have been able to put anything there anyway. Okay, is there any... There's a candle right there. Perfect. Okay, this door is unlocked. Just like the back door is unlocked. All the doors are unlocked. That might not be good. What does it want? Iron? Different type of door. I think there's different types of doors in this as well. Alright, there's no patio up here. So we can take our torch. Candle. Put it right there. Little ambiance. Little ambiance. No! I need wood. No, that's not wood. That's wood. That's gonna take forever. Oh, shoot. Alright, fine. Go outside. This is a mistake. Yeah. I'm not chopping trees down. I could use one of those explosive barrels for my uh, light source, but I think that... Oh, I'm using the wrong thing. No wonder it was taking so long. <laughs> they look the same in your hand. You gotta look down at your hotbar to see if you're using the right one. A rip. Yeah. They could have used the sledge. Um, if it's a hammer, they could have either used the claw hammer. Uh, uh, icon. I'm not icon, but uh, in-game animation whatever it's called, or the sledge. That would be better for a quote, air quote, hammer. Hammer, hello. I'm actually, like I said, I'm really looking forward to this now. Wait. That gather wood thing. Do you have to have 10,000 at one time? You see how it started over? Oh, you. Evil. Evil! I'll figure out a way to do that. That's not a problem, getting that wood. Actually, it's not a problem for any of that stuff, really. Okay. We're good, we're good. Hope you guys don't mind me starting over. You're like, eh, we hate episode ones anyway, and you're doing two? I know, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know, I know. What was I repairing? This. Perfect. There. Nice and dark. I got me a little table and chairs. I got an easy chair there. I could put a computer over there. Actually got a bed. I wish you could just claim these types of beds, you know? This is not a bad place. And we're, we're in plain view of the uh, 
of the other thing. All right, so that being said, let's, before I go, let's take a quick look at this. Okay, so what this is going to give us is 3,000 XP, a new, cla a new quest, a two of five, a uh, chain reward of XP. So you got XP stuff, all different kinds of stuff. Okay, so survivalist class, gather wood, 10 of 10, aloe cream, craft a splint. First, so you got to get duct tape, cloth, and be able to craft that bandage, okay? Iron, there's another wood, glue. You can see the basics here. Kill any animal, craft reinforced iron, okay? Tradesman, scrap stuff, that'll be later on. Duct tape. All right. Gather electrical parts, 150. So the good thing about this is when you get that um, HD wrench, remember the HD wrench, how fast it is? Now, if they didn't change it, this stuff will be easy mode, right? 25 animals. Covert. We have to kill 25 animals. All right. Well, <laughs> that's what we're in for. What time is it? 1826? I got to look through. Do I have any actual skill points? I have five. Rocket recipe. Let's see, I'm thinking I usually like to do survivor, camel, run forest run, then a weapon smithing and tool smithing. Those are like my first ones I like to grab. And food is usually the harder one to do. Hunger degradation minus five, wellness gain plus five percent, thirst degradation. Stamina. This gives you plus 50. So this will start at 25. So at least if I do this one, let's buy that one. I can, um, should be able to repair this, right? To 48. That'll work. I should be able to make one. Now that's called a, that's the regular stone axe. Interesting. Interesting they gave us that. So stone hammer. Okay. Plant fibers and wood. Can make all that stuff. Wouldn't mind just going out and... I might just go out and get a bunch of trees. Anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to chill out, you guys. We're going to come back on day two. Um, probably... I don't really need to make a, a, a storage unit yet, but I'm going to make one just so I can... Get rid of some junk for right now because a lot of this stuff i want to keep in my inventory because it re it's required it's required to get your um like get rid of that that cotton i'll keep this stuff that keep that wooden bow yeah i guess we'll keep this wooden bow for now because we do have actually have three sets of arrows what is this Iron. So this is like scrap or, or stone. This is iron and this is flaming. <laughs> Found those all in a stump. All right, you guys. If you guys are happy that I got this thing updated and you're excited to see all this stuff, because realistically, for like, I don't know, let's say we do 20 episodes, we're going to have all kinds of stuff that we're building toward that whole time. And that's more exciting than just me bumping my gums all the time. So if you're excited too, consider hitting the like button. Leave me a comment down below saying, cool, man, I'm glad you updated. Good looking out. And thank you guys for noticing that I didn't actually take when I first did it. All right, I'll see you guys on day two.